What is up guys, welcome back and today I'm going to show you how to upload a video to YouTube. Now before you can upload a video to YouTube, you're going to need to make a YouTube account. Now if you have not done that already, go ahead and click on that annotation that has just popped up and that will take you to my video that walks you through the steps and the process of how to make your own YouTube channel. So once you're done with that, go ahead and come on back to this video and I'll show you how to upload your video to YouTube. So once you're done recording and editing and making all your fancy dancy special effects onto your video and you want to upload this thing to YouTube, go ahead and go to the YouTube homepage. And you're going to want to make sure that you are uh, signing into your YouTube account where you want to upload this video. So once all that is set, go ahead and click on this upload button and that'll take you to the upload screen that looks exactly like this. And what we're going to do is select files to upload. So we're going to click this red button right here and this brings you to uh, all the files that are on your computer. Now what this is going to do, you're going to go through and uh, find the videos that you want to upload. And so make sure that you know where you saved your finished uh, your finished movie product so that you can find it easily. I'm just going to go to videos because that's where I have all my videos. I'm going to go just to uh, the how to make your own YouTube account that I just made. Please go ahead and watch that if you have not already. And it's going to start uploading right away as you can see. And so uh, really uploading a video uh, is determined by two things. That is the video size. If it's a big file, it's going to take a long time to download. If it's a small file, it's going to be very quick as you just saw. And also, if it's a good Wi-Fi connection, you'll have uh, faster uploading and processing speed. And if it's a bad connection, you will have bad of both. And so there's two tabs here. You're going to see basic info and then the advanced settings. We're just going to go over the basic info real quick. This right here is going to be the title of your video. So you can change this as much as you want. I'm just going to type 2014. You can change it as much as you want. You can have it as long as you want or as short as you want. It does not matter. You're going to go over here into the description. Just type a little description about your uh, video. I'm just going to write a tutorial about how to make a YouTube account. 2014. Ah, blah. 2014. And you can make it your description as long or as short as you want. Now, this tags right here, this is actually a really important part of uploading a video because tags, once uh, someone searches in the search engine, uh, YouTube goes ahead and searches all the tags of your video. So tags are very important. I'm just going to do something really basic right now. I'm just going to do tutorial, uh, YouTube, video, and in, uh, in education, education. And you can make that as long as you want. And also the suggested tabs comes up. So go ahead and click a bunch of those. I just like to click as much as I can because uh, the more tags I have, the more uh, traction I am able to get on YouTube, which is a good thing. So we're going to move over to this top right-hand tab over here. And we're going to click it. And uh, three, three options pop up. Public, unlisted, or private. Public means that uh, anyone on YouTube can come and find your video. Uh, unlisted means that no one can find your video except for you. Private means that no one can find your video unless they give, unless you give them a link to go to your video and also you can find your video. But only people who have the link can go to it. I'm just going to leave it private because that's uh, the simplest way to do it. Down to the next thing you can edit. This is right here is your message box. And basically what this is is uh, you can type whatever you want here again. So just YouTube account. I can't spell today. YouTube account tutorial uh, 2014 and that message will be played uh, and given to your subscribers so they'll be aware of any video that you post and uh, whatever you type here they will see oh don't okay, click off that and you can also share on Google Plus if you have that checked and you can also share on Twitter now I don't have my account linked to Twitter because I'm a newer account and I haven't done that yet but it doesn't matter once you link that up just type in your username and password and once you link that up uh, all your videos will be sent to Twitter. And so next tab we have is add to playlist. And basically what a playlist is, I'm pretty sure you guys know this, but um, it's basically a list or a group of videos that um, you select and you can watch them in an order. Like if someone has a Let's Play series, you can watch them in first to whatever, 20th. So that's very handy. Uh, I like to have playlist uh, of tutorials and stuff. So I'm just going to do a YouTube tutorial. Oh, they must remember me from uh, my other channels. Whatever, uh, you can type in, again, whatever you want to name your uh, playlist. And once you click create, it will automatically uh, put in your video to there. And you can obviously unclick it or click it. I'm just going to click it, which is very nice. And also, it's very nice because in this uploading screen, you can upload your video straight to the playlist, which is also a very nice thing. One thing I am noticing is that um, 
there is no custom thumbnail button here there is usually a custom thumbnail button here which uh, you can make your own thumbnails a thumbnail is the videos these little videos uh, when you're searching for a video that's what you see the image you see um, when coming across videos uh, maybe it's that I'm a newer channel but I will figure that out and uh, I will do a video separately on thumbnails for you guys speaking of thumbnails our video is completely processed and now all these thumbnails pop up so you don't even have to make your own custom thumbnail even though I prefer it but uh, if you're just starting off YouTube automatically selects three thumbnails randomly uh, they're basically just screenshots of your video and you can select them and uh, it'll show that'll be what the audience sees before they click on your video uh, so that's really handy if you don't want to uh, make your own thumbnail but I do and I'll show a video on that later um, so we're gonna move on to the advanced settings now this is a bunch of stuff we're gonna go through it uh, step by step uh, right here we have comments and you can either allow comments or if you unclick it you can disable content or comments and uh, approved means that comments whenever someone makes a comment uh, you will get an email and say oh do you approve this comment I just click all because it doesn't really matter to me uh, users can view ratings for this video uh, analytics uh, how users can view how much views your video has gotten I don't know I just leave it up there because it doesn't matter to me uh, standardized license uh, this is once you monetize your videos which I will do another video on you can uh, this is how you make money on YouTube is right here this uh, monetize but we're just gonna skip that for now uh, certificate this is if you have product placement or anything in there uh, this is when you notify subscribers this is just a uh, this is just a bunch of stuff uh, allow embedding I don't even know what that means others allow others to embed your video in their sites oh, okay so if someone wants to uh, put their video on their website this allows them to do that of course if you don't want it just unclick uh, age enable age restriction if your video is somehow uh, not appropriate for people under 18 you click that and it will do uh, have people sign in and do their age or whatever most of that is just uh, formal stuff that's not really super important unless you are worried about that kind of stuff but we're gonna go over here to category we're gonna click on that you can select anything that you want in here whatever your video is about mine is about how to install it's a how to video on how to make your own YouTube channel so I'm gonna click on how to after you've selected your category you can select the video location this basically is you can select where um, you recorded your video I don't usually do this because I think it's a little pointless so but you can do it you can also search and uh, type in your address and or your city and it'll show uh, where you made your video again I don't really use that um, select a language you can search a language like I don't know Russian or something but I don't speak Russian so I just click English because I speak English <laughs> and recording date I just click today whenever I upload it uh, 3d if somehow you can do 3d I don't really know how to do that so I just put no preference and makes the video statistics on the page on the watch page publicly visible this is the same thing as uh, ratings for the video but uh, it's it's basically the same thing people can see uh, publicly how your video is doing views wise and all that other random stuff so uh, really this advanced settings is a lot of stuff I don't really get into it I basically all I do is select a category uh, select my language set the coordinate today today and uh, I monetize my stuff so that's basically it and uh, since our processing is done uh, I think we have everything sorted out so we're just gonna publish and now it will say your video has been published and I'm gonna go ahead and click on that link and that'll bring me to my video right here and that's an awesome video you just go check that out we'll wink wink so one more thing before I go once YouTube has uploaded a video usually except not in this case because yeah because uh because I the upload was fast and I was talking a lot um, usually they upload uh, the setting the quality is only in like 140 or 240p which really freaked me out for a while until after like 10 minutes and then I got my 1080p HD back which is very nice anyways so just watch out for that if uh, your video is in 240p don't worry it will get fixed in about 10 20 minutes so hopefully you all uh, learned hopefully I explained everything clearly if not uh, just ask me again in the comments and I will hopefully explain clearly. If you guys want any more videos about uh, YouTube Administrator, like uh, how to upload thumbnails, which I'll do, and how to upload uh, art, uh, channel art in the background, and how to basically run your channel, I will do that as well. 
Uh, so thank you all for watching. Hope you all like and subscribe and hope you all enjoyed. And I will talk to you guys later. Go ahead and click on this upload button. And that will take you to the upload screen. It looks exactly like this. And what we're going to do is select files to upload. So we're going to click this red button right here. And this brings you to uh, all the files that are on your computer. Now what this is going to do, you're going to go through and uh, find the videos that you want to upload. And so make sure that you know where you saved your finished, uh, your finished movie product so that you can find it easily. I'm just going to go to videos because that's where I have all my videos. I'm going to go just to uh, the how to make your own YouTube account that I just made. Please go ahead and watch that if you have not already. And it's going to start uploading right away, as you can see. And so uh, really uploading a video uh, is determined by two things. That is the more tags I have, the more uh, traction I am able to get on YouTube, which is a good thing. So we're going to move over to this top right-hand tab over here, and we're going to click it. And uh, three three options pop up, public, unlisted, or private. Public means that uh, anyone on YouTube can come and find your video. Uh, unlisted means that no one can find your video except for you. Private means that no one can find your video unless they give unless you give them a link to go to your video, and also you can find your video. But only people who have the link can go to it. I'm just going to leave it private because that's uh, the simplest way to do it. Down to the next thing you can edit. This is right here is your message box. And basically what this is, is uh, you can type whatever you want here. Again, the video size, if it's a big file, it's going to take a long time to download. If it's a small file, it's going to be very quick as you just saw. And also, if it's a good Wi-Fi connection, you'll have uh, faster uploading and processing speed. And if it's a bad connection, you will have bad of both. And so there's two tabs here. You're going to see basic info and then the advanced settings. We're just going to go over the basic info real quick. This right here is going to be the title of your video. So you can change this as much as you want. I'm just going to type 2014. You can change it as much as you want. You can have it as long as you want or as short as you want. It does not matter. You're going to go over here into the description. Just type a little description about your uh, video. I'm just going to write a tutorial about how to make a YouTube account. What is up guys? Welcome back and today I'm going to show you how to upload a video to YouTube. Now before you can upload a video to YouTube, you're going to need to make a YouTube account. Now if you have not done that already, go ahead and click on that annotation that has just popped up and that will take you to my video that walks you through the steps and the process of how to make your own YouTube channel. So once you're done with that, go ahead and come on back to this video and I'll show you how to upload your video to YouTube. So once you're done recording and editing and making all your fancy dancy special effects onto your video and you want to upload this thing to YouTube, go ahead and go to the YouTube homepage. And you're going to want to make sure that you are uh, signing into your YouTube account where you want to upload this video. So once all that is set, go 2014. Ah, blah, 2014. And you can make it your description as long or as short as you want. Now this tags right here, this is actually a really important part of uploading a video because tags, once uh, someone searches in the search engine, uh, YouTube goes ahead and searches all the tags of your video. So tags are very important. I'm just gonna do something really basic right now. I'm just gonna do tutorial, uh, YouTube, video, and in, uh, in education, education. And you can make that as long as you want. And also the suggested tabs comes up. So go ahead and click a bunch of those. I just like to click as much as I can because uh, 